it seems like it may be working, and if it is, they're going to expand it, but um, it's probably the best immediate solution there is in the toolbox right now. However, can that uh, issue more problems in terms of storing up the sediments that have cupped, um, trapped that sulfide gas? Uh, there could be a little bit of sediment disturbance depending on how deep the water is, but uh, Oh, and there may be a bit of an initial rise in the gas concentrations when the when the uh, paddles are, are first cranked up. But that should all subside if it's actually doing its work. And it seems like it is pumping a lot of uh, oxygen into the water. It's acting a lot like a, a rapid in a river. A rapid does the same thing. It, it oxygenates the water. But a lot of the organisms that are going to be affected probably already have been. And uh, when the rains start, there's going to be a lot of disturbance of the sediment then as well. So that'll be a natural event that we can't really control. And uh, that will probably also have an impact. There is no real quick fix. It's a long-term fix. Uh, the problem is we've been abusing our rivers for way too long. And unless we change our ways, we're going to see more and more of this and it's going to become more intense.